match days, the, we call it the glory day, where you know we, we present the pitch for the game and make sure everything's perfect for the for the players later on to play tonight. But the main work is actually done in between the games, and today's the, the final touches. Actually, it's, it's quite simple. It's just the direction of the grass is lying in, and to achieve that is we have the, the roller on the front and the roller on the back, and, and this, these rollers will push the grass in a certain direction, and this is what will give us our striping effect. The amount of fertilizer and chemicals and different things that we apply to the pitch to make it look the way it does, the grass grows very quick. And let's say we mowed this twice yesterday, uh, and it's almost probably grown maybe six, seven millimeters overnight. Normally, I think the rule is that you know we try and keep the white line the same width as the goalpost, so everything matches up. And, and the amount of money that's in the game now, you know, one inch over the, the white line can make the difference between a goal or not a goal, and that has consequences and who wins the match. Fingers crossed, not a lot of things have gone too wrong, but. You know, all the groundsmen have had things in the past, like uh, you know the water, the, the, the sprinklers coming on during the game, and that's my that's my biggest worry. So you sit there, you don't really enjoy the game so much. You're thinking of all the things maybe that could go wrong, but you know it's part and parcel of the job. So this is part of our final checks now, where we've cut the pitch, we've put the white lines, the goals, the corner flags, and we're, we're almost done now. And, it's uh, getting ready for the game now um, and ready then for the watering of the pitch later just before kickoff.